Hi, so I am going to be doing the weekly horoscope reading for Sagittarius. So I'll be covering next Monday, the 13th of December, until next Sunday, the 19th of December. And yeah, like usual, we'll cover each individual day of the week, just so that you get a really, really good idea of what you can expect next week. And yeah, let's delve straight into the tarot and find out what we've got going on next week. Okay, so next week, right, it's like you've got, you, okay, next week there's like one person in particular who's, who's weighing on your mind, okay, it's kind of like you've got quite a few insecurities surrounding this person, you've got quite a few anxieties surrounding this person, and it's kind of leaving you feeling a little bit trapped at the moment, okay, but you can still flip the week. This is still a really, really good week ahead of you. And you've still got like all this achievement and this successful energy surrounding you, right? But you're, you're just at the same time, it's like, it's these insecurities, okay? It's like if you don't, like they're, they're well founded, right? This is what I do need to say. They've got firm foundations, okay? It's not like they're insecurities that are made up or that aren't valid. They are totally valid, okay? And you have every right to be feeling consumed by them. But for your best being, right? For your best being, it's like you, you want to use the power that's deep within you and work out what's got you feeling like this and why and, and identify it. But then it's kind of like you want to free yourself because you've got all the power, man, to flip this week and and to delve into all this success and, and, and achievement that's surrounding you. It's just like if you're stuck in your head, then you're going to be frozen in your head, right, in the past, which means you're going to miss out on the present and what's coming, okay? So it's like you just want to try to get out of there because it is it is linked into this person. Person, okay and it is valid I will say that now Monday's got you in a position where it's like you're almost there okay you need to keep going your endurance is what's going to get you where you want to be on Monday and it's what's going to get you the outcome that you're seeking it's like you you want to dig deep and and it's your independence it's your self-reliance okay it's not like nobody else is going to get you there on monday it's all about you but it's it's like you can see that it's like you're you're just starting to get little tastes of that success that you're you're looking for it's like you're just starting to see that your efforts could start to pay off you know and maybe you will see fruit from all your hard work soon so it's like you're in this real like almost there just don't give up don't get swayed remember that you've got that drive within you that's going to be your best ally on monday uh tuesday's got you going into a position where it's like Okay, so I'm getting the feeling, it, it's kind of like you've, you've turned your back in a sense, right? And this is linked in because it's like there is some sort of third force causing dramas for you, okay? There's some sort of third force and, and, and it's got its own total agenda here, its own motives and, and it's just kind of like watch out, okay? It's like you want to watch out of others because there's there's it's like you don't have the full picture okay it's kind of like you're not fully aware of everything there's still quite a few things that that are murky that are clouded okay and you don't know everything there so it's kind of like um you just want to watch out you want to watch out and be wary of that that's all uh, you're going to find Wednesday's got you in a position where it's like, man, anything is possible. And it's like, you you know that too. And it's like, you're currently going down this path where you're trying to make your dreams a reality, where you're trying to turn your, your dream, your passion into something, okay? Or it might even be the total lifestyle change that you're seeking, right? But it's like, it's like you can do it. You're, it's totally attainable. You're not there yet. There's going to be a few bumps along the way and there's going to be a few bumps on Wednesday, right? But don't let that sway you off going after what it is that you really, really want because you're going to get there and you're going to come out on top and it's going to bring you so much harmony and joy when you do, okay? You're going to find Thursday. So Thursday's got you in a position where it is like, 
anything you want to do on Thursday, just go for it, okay? Again, it's this success, this achievement I keep talking about. It is all around you, okay? You are oozing this passion, this creativity. You're oozing this real energy that people are going to be drawn to, okay? And some people consciously, some people subconsciously. So don't be surprised if they come to you, all right? Uh, don't be surprised if they all center around you. Just bask in it. Step out there and enjoy it because it's all you. It's all from your efforts, your talents. It's like... You're what's gotten you here, okay? And you've had bumps along the road and you've had hardships along the road and you've had things that have hardened you in life as well. But it's like Thursday's like, you know, all those hardships, all those bumps, all those things that have that have come along the way. It's like that's all part of making you, you and helping you get to this place where where whether you're just oozing this 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 awesome energy okay just embrace it embrace you it's all about you on thursday that's what i'm feeling uh friday's got you going into this place where okay so you have got you you've got security all right it's like whatever this passion is that you're going after and all that you know you can make it into something tangible and you can use it to bring you security into the future okay to bring you that that financial stability that you're seeking and you can have this long term there is so much potential around it okay but it's still like in the baby stages it's still in the little early growing stages you do have all this talent you do have all this potential but you've got to keep growing it okay keep growing it and growing it and you can carry it in long term you're gonna find Saturday's got you in this place where you are just propelling down this whole new start okay you are down this whole new start it's like a total transition down a new beginning and it's like on Friday it's like it's it's like it, it, it's like the path is, has presented itself, right, as a result of you taking the reins back in your life. It's like you've decided that you know what you want, you know what you don't want, you know how to get there. And all of a sudden, by taking that steering wheel back and taking control of the decisions and the direction that your life heads in, right, it's like all of a sudden this is just presenting this whole new path, this whole new route that has so many new opportunities for you, okay? And so many, so much good energy and and good is going to come to you if you continue down this path, all right? And, and, and the only thing that's going to sway you is if you give those reins back and stop making those decisions for yourself, okay? Because I'm feeling like on Saturday you have just seized control of where you're going in, in, in the best way possible, okay? Uh, Sunday's got you in this place where, again, like I was just saying, you've turned your back on that negativity, okay? You've turned your back. For a lot of you, I'm feeling like this negativity is linked into that person, okay? Maybe it's this person I was talking about before, but I feel like there's definitely... You, you've kind of said enough's enough on Sunday. For some of you, I feel like you've totally walked away. For others of you, it's like you've walked away in a sense of you've somehow managed to, to come to a point where you can change it, where you're not going through this same dysfunction and this same cycle. But I feel like for most of you, it's like you've just clearly said enough is enough. And there is an ending associated with this, okay? There is a death of something associated here, which is why I feel like a lot of you are kind of like walking away because you're feeling that loss, you're feeling that grief, okay? But it's like, like I was just saying, that new beginning, right? This death is so necessary because how do you have a new beginning without an ending, you know? So the even even if it feels a little bit rough at stages it's like you know you're doing everything right because removing that negativity is is only the best thing you can do okay um and 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 it's like it's just paramount okay you have to close those doors in order for all these new ones to come all right which is gonna bring you so 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 much joy which is so gonna be worth it Okay, and don't forget, sometimes the really hard things in life, you know, they're the things that are the best things, okay? Sometimes the hardships and all that, they make us so much stronger, okay? And and those tough things that can sometimes hold us frozen, you know, they can be the things that 
that that we can grow and learn and really become who we're supposed to be so yeah anyways i hope that helps thank you very much for watching i really appreciate you taking the time i know your time is precious please hit that like button and please subscribe it's the best way to support me and my channel and yeah um there was one other thing i have content out every day new tarot readings out daily so please subscribe and keep an eye out thank you Mwah, appreciate you